Hey guys, Jeff the Nature Guy, and I hope you can hear me because I got some loud little animals behind me, especially this guy right here. I don't think he's real happy that I'm sitting next to him. Do you guys know what this is? It's a goose, and he's a crazy goose. He's called a domesticated goose. He's a little bit different than the wild ones that are out in the wild, and this particular kind you can find out in the wild over in Europe, and there's a couple species in Africa. A couple ways you can tell that he's domestic and not wild. First of all, he's got a big rear end, and I don't mean to be mean to him, but he's got a big bump on the rear end there. The wild ones do not have that. The other thing is, this guy, when he stands up straight, he puts his head up really high. The wild ones don't do that. They keep their heads kind of low. This guy's got a real tall kind of walk to him. But nonetheless, they're really neat animals. And the domesticated species, they were domesticated, which means people raised them around their house and sometimes in their house as long as 4,000 years ago. I mean, it's believed that these guys were around in, in near houses and farms for a long, long time. And they were bred, they were kept in, the, in that area, in the farm or what have you, for a couple reasons. One, of course, for their eggs. You can eat their eggs just like chicken eggs. Well, the other reason, don't listen guys, is for their meat. People did eat these guys a lot like they did chicken. But the other reason I think is most interesting is that a lot of people like to have these animals in their yard as watchdogs, or should I say watch geese. They're really good at protecting your house. And what they do is just like this guy is doing, he likes to get real close to you and he likes to try to scare you. And if they need to, they'll even bite and kick you. So that's why I'm keeping an eye on this guy because he might just attack me here to get him out, get me out of his house. And when they are very used to being in a territory, they will do that even if it's a human house. They will protect it just like a watchdog would do. How cool is that? So these geese have been around and here at the zoo, we've got a couple different kinds. We got these ones here. We got these incredible white ones. They look a lot like that Aflac duck you see on the commercials, you know, Aflac, that guy, they're pretty cool. And when you get to the zoo, you can actually interact with these guys. You can get really close to them. You can talk with them. They'll talk back to you. It's a lot of fun to see these guys at the zoo. And unfortunately, they're not, I think, talked about enough here at the zoo. And so that's why we wanted to do this video today to introduce you to them because they're a lot of fun to watch and they're kind of goofy even to see them up and close. So make sure you come and check these guys out. Until next time, guys, I am Jeff the Nature Guy with the Noisy Geese here at the zoo. Make sure you come on by and see them. They, 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 they like some visitors. See you soon.